Mi-8 Arctic rotary wing aircraft, which was developed by the Russian Helicopters Holding Company, is a significant improvement in technology that has been specifically designed to withstand the severe and unforgiving conditions of the Arctic. This variant is built upon the A8AMT platform, which has been proven to be multi-purpose and it integrates various design innovations to guarantee dependable operation in some of the most extreme environments on Earth. The Mi-8 SMT is a modification of the Mil Mi-8, a medium twin turbine helicopter that was developed first by the Soviet Central Aerohydrodynamic Institute in the 1960s and entered service in 1967. The Mi-8 series is known for its adaptability as it is capable of performing various functions, such as transport, reconnaissance, armed gunship, and airborne command post. The Mi-8 SMT variant is an upgraded model that has been equipped with improved avionics and engines to enhance its operational capability and performance. It can be equipped with rockets, bombs, and machine guns for combat support missions, and can typically transport up to 24 soldiers or equivalent cargo. The Mi-8 family continues to be one of the most frequently produced and extensively used helicopters worldwide, and it is highly regarded for its adaptability and reliability in various environments. The Arctic Mi-8 is distinguished by its distinctive engine quick start system, which allows the helicopter to initiate its engines at temperatures as low as minus 60 degrees centigrade. This capability is essential for Arctic operations as temperatures frequently fall below the threshold of conventional aviation equipment. The quick start system is particularly advantageous when the helicopter is deployed autonomously, which is a frequent occurrence in remote Arctic missions, and it is dispersed from the support of hangars or ground-based thermal equipment. The cargo cabin's interior is evidence of the extensive understanding of the operational obstacles that exist in the Arctic. It is outfitted with a robust heating system and sophisticated thermal insulation to guarantee the safety of both the crew and the cargo in cold weather. The design includes provisions for the warming of food rations and water, which are essential for the survival of personnel on protracted missions. The cabin's capacity to retain heat is further improved by thermal draperies, which creates a more comfortable environment for both the crew and the passengers. Operating in the Arctic presents unique navigational challenges, such as the polar night, protracted periods of darkness, and vast, featureless landscapes. Additionally, the high latitude and geomagnetic interference can result in unreliable satellite and radio communications. The Arctic Mi-8 is equipped with cutting-edge navigation and communication systems to surmount these challenges. These consist of satellite communication terminals that are engineered to sustain connectivity in regions with intermittent or feeble signals, advanced inertial navigation systems, and GLONASS GPS dual-system receivers. High-performance VK2500 engines, which are manufactured domestically in Russia, are the engines that drive the Arctic Mi-8. These engines are particularly well known for their power output and reliability, particularly in low temperature environments. The helicopter's twin engine configuration enables it to sustain horizontal flight and even gain altitude in the event of an engine failure, a critical safety feature for overwater and remote area operations. Each of the VK2500 engines is an improvement over previous models, providing up to 2,700 horsepower and enhanced gasoline efficiency, which is essential for long-range missions. Another area in which the Arctic Mi-8 excels is its operational range. The helicopter can travel distances greater than 1,400 kilometers in a single flight and has a maximum flight duration of over seven hours when additional fuel containers are used. In the vast, tiny populated Arctic region, this extended range is crucial for search and rescue missions, supply trips, and emergency evacuations. The Ministry of Emergency Situations of Russia, as well as other government agencies engaged in Arctic exploration, resource exploitation, and environmental monitoring, has actively deployed the Arctic Mi-8. The fleet of Arctic-modified Mi-8 helicopters has been instrumental in the support of Russia's expanding presence in the region, including the construction and maintenance of polar research stations, 
the delivery of supplies to remote outposts, and the rapid response to emergencies such as oil spills or natural disasters, as indicated by recent reports. In 2024, Russian helicopters announced additional improvements to the Arctic Mi-8, such as the integration of digital cockpit displays, improved composite rotor blades, and improved de-icing systems, which will result in increased efficiency and durability. The company also disclosed that it has supplied more than 30 units of the Arctic Mi-8 to various Russian government agencies. The company intends to increase the fleet in the future as part of the country's comprehensive Arctic development strategy. In conclusion, the Arctic Mi-8 helicopter is a testament to the adaptability of Russian engineering to one of the most difficult environments on Earth. It is a critical asset for assuring the safety, connectivity, and operational effectiveness of missions conducted in the Arctic's extreme conditions due to its extended range, robust safety features, and advanced cold weather capabilities. Now, do you think the Mi-8 is still relevant in the Arctic? Let us know in the comments. Please feel free to like, share, and subscribe to our channel.